Wow. She's on the move. Do you think a guy can do it, guys? I don't know. I'm feeling pretty nervous. Feeling pretty nervous. Got the AC blasting because I am sweating like a pig in here. That was Bahia Honda State Park. We're moving on to the next destination. Where could it be? Let's go. I don't know the song. It's a classic. I'm not white enough. <laughs> beautiful views. Beautiful views. Beautiful. Beautiful. First cool thing of the day. It's a little fish with a big nose. It's called the Jewish fish. No, I'm kidding. So that was the Blue Hole, guys. A really nice place in the Big Pine Key. Nice. Middle this. to lower keys. Watch this. You ready? Did you guys hear that? All right, so that was Blue Hole. I'm kidding. <laughs> Blue Hole, Big Pine <laughs> Key. Yeah, I'm fucking out. And it was a really cool observation point um, between Marathon and Key West. We got to see some alligator. She's on the move. Wow. Look at those teeth dangling out of his mouth. That's so crazy. Did you see him blink? Yeah. And some uh, key pine deer, which were like little Bambi in real life. Over the road, please. He's so cute. It's a shy deer, guys. He's definitely looking for food. Uh, cutie. So it was really cool. As you can see, we're just stopping to get a little snack before we're on our way to the next destination. So if you guys are enjoying the video so far, please do me a huge favor and just scroll down and click subscribe. Through my analytics, I am able to see that 99.1%, gotta get that point one in there, of all my views and watch time is coming from people who are not even subscribed to the channel, which is pretty much every single person, except for my subscribers. I love and I see you guys out there. If you really would consider clicking subscribe, it would be awesome. I'm close to monetizing my channel. I just need to get to 1,000 subs. That's all for my little ad break. Let's get back to the video. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, this is it. It's awesome. It's okay. I'm not do it. All right, Wanderers. So we are at the Jumping Bridge in Sugarloaf Key. And as you can see, we're just having a good old time. There's a little bridge. No one's coming around here. I just, we're jumping around. My boy Boosted Chef here is about to jump in a minute. Oh, me? No. Yeah. And I'm, do you think a guy can do it, guys? I don't know. I'm feeling pretty nervous. Feeling pretty nervous, but First day, for you guys, I just might. I just might.
All right, Wanderers, that was the Sugarloaf Bridge. A lot of fun. I did a lot of gnarly jumps. So did Vanessa. My boy Chef did not, but I still love him. We are at our hotel of the night before we head to Key West for a wild, riveting party boy lifestyle day. But you know me, I'm kind of a budget hotel kind of guy, just to be honest. I'd rather spend my money doing other things like activities and experiences and food and that sort of thing. But if this place does not have a balcony with a water view, I'm walking out. I have no idea, guys. Let's go find out. <laughs> I locked myself out. <laughs> Vanessa, I locked myself out. I'm not interested. Bye. <laughs> no. All right, yeah, so I've already been in my hotel and let's check it out. This is budget, guys. This is budget near Key West. Now, in case you don't know, in staying in Key West costs anywhere from, if you're lucky, three to four hundred dollars. After a week for the night, and look, look at that pretty painting, guys. That looks just like Anne's Beach where we hit up the other day. This is Sugarloaf Lodge, which is in the lower uh, Sugarloaf Key, which is only 20 minutes away from Key West. So it's pretty proximal. It's not a bad option, but as you can see, it's still not bad at all. Got nice water views, balcony. And then yeah, we're just gonna get nice and comfy and chill. Then head out to the last place of the day for day two in the Florida Keys, guys. Let's hit it. 